because you know it's not easy to go to you know be in Champions League squads. So you obviously did something right. Any advice you have for for the youngsters? What you did in terms of managing time between school and, and you know which mm -hmm. main priority football? Mm -hmm. and, uh, yeah, I think this was the the biggest thing that I had to. Managing time, you know, I think uh, mm -hmm. that's huge if you want to be a pro, uh, if you want to be successful with anything you do in life. Uh, and, and I'm sure you, you you know, I always talk about it with, with other friends who are pros and, and, you know, other people, my clients. You know, football teaches us these these key characteristics that are going to help us in other, other areas of our life, you know, in the future. And obviously, you, you learn it at, at a young age. How are you able to, to manage your time? Uh, you know, as, as a big time academy player as well as going to school because it's not easy, you know, what were your, did you have any, um, did you prioritize things? Did you have to cut out some, some distractions, some parts of social life? How were you able to focus and hone in on the craft? Because, you know, it's not easy to go to, you know, be in Champions League squad. So you obviously did something right. So any advice you have for, for the youngsters, what you did in terms of managing time between school and, and you know, which mm -hmm. your main priority, football, mm -hmm. you know? <laughs> yeah, back then at the youth time, it was uh, not easy to, to manage the time because yeah, yeah the, the all day long I was uh, doing a lot of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, yeah, to the part of the, the football and the, the school part, it was like I had the goal in football to, to achieve, to, mm -hmm. to go to, uh, to professional clubs. Mm -hmm. And uh, on the school way, I really wanted to, to finish the, the this part of school mm -hmm. because uh, yeah it's like the, the basics to to go to university after yeah and uh, yeah for me it was important to do this as well because uh, in football you never have to guarantee that you you will turn pro or you always have to have a plan b that's a great point. you never know maybe one day you you don't get a new contract or you get injured mm -hmm. so yeah you don't have any uh, assurance to mm -hmm. To go on with this, and even if you have a good um, career, mm. maybe with uh, 35, maybe even at 40, if you do it very well and yeah, everybody yeah, does yeah. it, uh, yeah, you, you still live for a long time and have to work for a long time. So exactly. I really wanted to have th this basic, and yeah, there was a, a part. And on the other hand, with the football and the, mm. the school, with the time, the, the spare time with uh, the friends and the family mm. was uh, a bit more behind. Yeah. On the weekends, uh, yeah. I could do it. I could go yeah. back home, uh, yeah. see my family and friends. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I think this was the, the the biggest thing that I had to take a little bit back. For sure. For sure. But yeah, mm. my, my family and friends, For yeah, sure. they were doing it very nicely. They uh, visited me. They yeah, yeah they uh, they helped me in, yeah, yeah, in this sure. way and also uh, understood it that. If I wanted to do that, maybe I have a little bit less time with mm. them. But uh, yeah, we still stayed in good uh, mm. contact. So uh, even now today, I spend a lot of time with them, and yeah, we yeah, didn't yeah. lose contact. For sure, for sure. Yeah, I mean, I think there's a couple points there. I mean, number one, the real ones will stay around. The ones who are meant to be your friends will stay around. Mm -hmm. Obviously, your family will always be there. And also, you know, I always say, you know do what you need to do so you can do what you want to do so it's like okay you know you put the work in during the week you really grind you put your head down and then on the weekend you can enjoy your relaxation that much more mm -hmm. i think when you put the work in it's so much easier to enjoy the time with family and friends than when you you know you just relax to relax you know and, and i think that's i mean that, that's something that i embody in, in myself it's like when you know uh you know, people could think I'm busy on my phone and computer and stuff like that. But when I'm with someone in person, you know, I mm -hmm. want to get off my phone and I want to truly be there, you know, exactly. feel, feel exactly. the energy, hang out, be present. And I think that that's that's so big. You know, I, th I think it goes a long way to, to build true friendships and, and relationships. Yeah, I think, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. taking a lot of time and uh, you all have to be confident in each other. Absolutely. So, yeah. But the, the most of them, I mean, in my back town, yeah. I know since uh, I was uh, a really small boy. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. yeah, it was just uh, improving like this. And uh, yeah, thanks God that I yeah. still have uh, such a good relationship sure. with them. Yeah. For sure, for sure. Hope you enjoyed that video. Make sure you click one of these two videos right here to stay up to date with the best football development channel here on YouTube. And most importantly, don't forget to drink your sparkling water. Deuces.